Hello everybody, this is GameBro64 and it's been a while since you've heard personally from me, but not for any reason other than just, you know, other things going on in life, but um, I wanted to bring a video today about um, Serious Sam Beta 2017. If you go into the editor, and I'm going to open up a map I've been working on here, but um, I don't. I haven't seen anybody put attention to it just quite yet. But you can actually splice both Serious Sam Three stuff and Serious Sam HD. I don't know if it's the best idea because uh, you do get some error message, for example, with the assault rifle and uh, uh, the Colt, uh, the pistol animations. However, they still do work, and I want to show you the differences between. Uh, what you can do because even if you can't use the weapons and you decide to use Serious Sam 3 as your base for your map instead of Serious Sam HD one interesting thing is that you can still use the uh, Serious Sam 3 enemies without any uh, without any problems uh, that I, I don't know if all the enemies but for the most part the ones that are the same as the ones from Serious Sam HD you can use them interchangeably without any problems uh, as you can see, I had a spawn here for a kamikaze. It was previously Serious Sam HD kamikaze, but now I have it as a Serious Sam 3 kamikaze, and the spawn still works exactly how it should. So let me show you here what I mean. So if we go into the game, you see I'm the base game that I have that I started working on this map was Serious Sam HD. As I, as you can see, the character is Serious Sam HD. And you've got the uh, the starting pistol from Serious Sam HD, but if I simply come over here and pick up the Serious Sam 3 pistol. I also have the pistol and the the Colt 45. Now, what's interesting about this is that uh, what I was saying is, you know, some things it doesn't show. So you can see that the pistol doesn't show in Serious Sam's hands, but if you come and pick up this minigun. You can see that this is the Serious Sam 3 minigun that Serious Sam is holding. So some things do work, some things do not. However, like I said, this still works, all the animations work, you can still aim, and you know, you can't do this pistol. But it's interesting that it's something that you can do, because um, for one it means you can add more weapons, because I, if you see I pick up this shotgun. I pick up this shotgun, it just layers over each other. So now I have the Serious Sam HD shotgun and the Serious Sam 3 shotgun. But as you've probably already noticed, the ammo types are different. So one thing that's interesting about this is that you can use both kinds of health and armor and it will affect the, the player normally. Uh, of course I'm not weak there so you can't see the health, but let's say I put on this armor and then I put on this armor. Well, I'm at max height, so it wouldn't work anyway, but... Let me see if I can show you an example. I'll be right back after I get wounded. Okay, so I'm back now that I've been wounded. And let me show you. So I had used the Serious Sam 3... Um, what was it? The Serious Sam 3 uh, armor. And now I use that armor, and it and it affected me how it would regularly. So the armors are fine as they add on to each other. And so let me adjust the mic. I don't have a stand right now, so it's just kind of awkwardly laying against my chest. But as you can see, what I was saying, uh, the ammo types though won't stack on top of each other. If I shoot this gun and I pick up Serious Sam HD ammo, I have ammo for Serious Sam HD shotgun. But for the Serious Sam 3 shotgun, I don't. I still have 7 rounds. And, um... I also wanted to show you the assault rifle. Everything works there, animations are fine. But another weapon that doesn't show up in your hands. Uh, and also gives you... I mean, it, it doesn't give you any error messages in-game, but when you actually go to your editor, I'll show you there in a second, that it has uh, an error message saying that it, it's named under AK-47, but it says that there's no animation for it. And here's another example of 
having the game the the Serious Sam HD weapon in game, but then the Serious Sam 3 weapon also shows up. So some weapons, I guess the ones with similar animations, work. Rocket launcher shows up fine. And so does the uh, Serious Sam HD one, which I didn't pick up. Which is funny because um, you can take a look at this and the explosion there. And they still, you know, you still have the Serious Sam HD or Serious Sam 3 explosion difference. And even just the way everything moves. There's like, you know, they. So it's possible to have both, both things. I want to see this incorporated into more levels. I'm definitely going to try now, for, for, for now on, but uh, not necessarily, you know, weapons. You know, obviously, uh, if you wanted to do Serious M3 uh, as the base, I don't, I don't even know how to do that because I started working on this before the update where they added Serious M3. But if you wanted to use the Serious M3 weapons but still have the textures from Serious Sam 3 or HD, or even uh, spawning enemies from both games, you're like actually able to do that now, which is crazy because I mean, they didn't used to be able to. I mean, you can't do that in many games. And I was kind of always been kind of hoping they'd do something like that with the. Uh, with the. Uh, the Serious Sam 2, but they never did. And so, it's just nice to see that there's that the change now. And here you can see the, the enemies in action. crazy to see because everything works like if it was intended to even though you get the the error messages with the uh, you know like the machine gun and the pistol and you can see me using it it does the damage intended and it's still uh, and the game doesn't crash so it's nice the only thing I can note is that and I'm not gonna show in this video but if you use the axe uh, from Serious Sam 3 uh, you'll use it just like normal and it'll still kill the enemy. However, there won't be any giving uh, Giving as in gore and there won't be um, You know like you can't glory kill. I don't know if you can do it with the hands uh, Unless you were doing serious same three as your base game but um, It's just something to throw out there. You know if you do try to do this stuff you gotta know You, you gotta know that that's gonna be something you can't do uh, or well, you can use it. I just don't know if it's safe to do it. You know, if you're gonna publish the map, because I mean, you know, I don't know if the I don't really honestly know a whole lot about what these error messages are. And here they are, right here. If you look in the bottom where my mouse is, you can see they say uh, uh, no matching entry and action animation scheme was found for the AK-47. And over here, you can see it talks about the Colt. But other than that, there's no. Um, error messages about the uh, the ammo pickups or armor pickups from Serious Sam 3 or even the fact that I have enemy spawns from Serious Sam 3 and HD together coinciding and of course I haven't like you know opened up all the uh, the creatures from both games to see if there's any mess error messages with any of them but it's just it's cool to see that there's that that they by tying in the games together and all the files that you can actually access them all together and you know heck maybe even make a cool variation that's somewhere in between both games using you know some some of both enemies like you know make a serious sam 3 map that uses these guys and you know the regular serious sam 3 enemies or whatever else is in serious sam hd that wasn't in in uh Serious Sam 3, like the, the jack-o'-lantern dudes, the Kirk Abitos. So, that being said, that's all I really got to say. Just wanted to touch base on this stuff. Uh, also, it seems they've changed up a little bit. I don't know if to make men's between Serious Sam 3 and HD, but if you want to add 
these uh the you know weapons armor whatever it's all going to be under tools and generic key items you're just going to bring that up then you're going to go to item params and here are your options for i think this one's serious sam 3 but if you want to go back you'll go to this page here and you can say let's go to serious sam hd you go to databases and on serious sam 3 it'll say just items but on serious sam hd it's going to be generic items and then from here, if you press ammo or weapons, you'll be able to you know, spawn whatever it is that you're trying to do. And for the enemies, it's pretty much the same as it's been in the past. Just that, you know, if you want to make it a Serious Sam 3, you'll go and you'll press back just like you would uh, to get the cult or the weapons or whatever. You'll just go back until you get to the Serious Sam 3 files and go into the same files to access their enemies. So that being said, thank you everybody for watching and we'll see you in the next video.